What's going on? Welcome to the channel. It's your man C-Stan. This video is going to be an unboxing and review of my favorite Elevated Essentials brand, Uniform LA. I'll be giving my honest review on a couple of their most popular shirts, as well as their brand new Sunset Court shorts, mesh shorts, which I'll be seeing for the first time today when we do the unboxing in a minute. Later I'll show myself wearing the clothes in a couple of outfits so you guys can see how they look on person. And then later we'll compare them to some other brands in the space such as John Elliott, Aimee Leon Dore, and Eric Emanuel for the shorts. Before we get into the unboxing, let me give you a little bit of background on Uniform LA, who they are and what they do. I've been a customer of Uniform LA for about a year now. I'm wearing one of their shirts right now. Basically, Uniform LA's mission is to make elevated essentials for everyday wear. They want to make getting dressed simple and easy for guys, okay? Um, they want to become your go-to throw-on shirt when you go in your closet. You want that comfy, great fitting, looks good shirt. You're reaching for that Uniform LA t-shirt. All clothing is sourced in the United States. All their clothes are designed and manufactured in Los Angeles. They partnered with US farmers to create fair paid manufacturing, sustainable sourcing, and eco-friendly business practices. So you know you're gonna get a great product, you're gonna get it for a great price, and you're gonna get one that's sustainably produced, unlike those fast fashion brands, H&M, Zara's. Okay, now we'll do the unboxing. Every time that I've ordered from U Uniform LA, you get a handwritten note from one of their founders, Pat. No other brand is doing stuff like this. Just love that personal touch. First thing in the bag is the Sunset uh, Court Shorts, the mesh shorts. I got them in a navy, extra large. We got the Artist Tee in white, also extra large. And then we got an artist long sleeve tee in twisted tri-blend in XL. Okay, got all the clothes opened up, so let's talk about them. First thing, the artist tee in white, short sleeve. This is made with premium 10.5 ounce Supima cotton, oversized slightly boxy fit, shoulder to shoulder tape added for durability, like I said, 100% Supima cotton. Remember, made in the USA. All materials sourced in the USA. Sustainably produced in Los Angeles. It's got a little bit of stretch to it, a little bit of give. My typical shirt size is an XL, and I went XL in these, and it does give you that little bit of oversized fit if you're looking for that. Artist Tee runs for $48. Next shirt we're gonna talk about is the Twisted Tri-Blend artist long sleeve t-shirt okay this is going to be a three material blend 50 percent polyester 38 percent cotton and 12 percent rayon for the long sleeve it's 58 all right last piece is the brand new sunset court shorts this is my first time having a pair of these shorts um i have three other of the artist tees this is an artist tee here and on first reaction, I, I really like them as far as construction goes. You can see they have a nice sturdy zippered pocket in the back with that black ribbing, love that. These shorts are lined on the inside, as you can see with fabric so that it's not mesh on mesh. It makes them a little bit heavier, more substantial. Two side pockets, right? Contrast cream colored drawstrings. So you can pop them out, hang them out if you wanna. I know lots of people fold our shorts over, let the strings hang, I like that. Um, no slits on the leg opening, and these will be 100% polyester construction. The first comparison I wanna talk about is the uniform Sunset Court shorts to the Eric Emanuel basic shorts. Price, $98 for the uniform, $98 for the basic Eric Emanuels. Now if you wanna get the Eric manuals that have designs or patterns on it, that's gonna be an additional 10 and be a 108 cost. Both shorts have side slit pockets. However, only the Uniform LA shorts 
have the back zippered pockets. Eric Emanuel shorts have no pockets in the back. Talking about construction, the Uniform LA shorts are double lined, so it'll be mesh on the outside with this smooth, almost silky feeling polyester liner. Eric Emanuel shorts is just a double layer of mesh, and it's not even crossed so that the holes are not see-through, it's lined up so you can see through the holes. More on construction, draw cords. Both shorts have drawstrings for the waistband, both elastic waist. However, as we can see, the Eric Emanuel drawstrings are kind of a not super high quality string, whereas the Uniform LA drawstrings are nice woven fabric strings as opposed to these cheap ones over here. The shorts have approximately the same inseam length. If I hold them up together, line up the waist and hold them up, you'll see that they pretty much align. The uniform might be a quarter of an inch cut longer. Last detail on construction I wanna talk about is the differences in the waistband. Eric Emanuel has a thicker waistband compared to the uniforms, and it's a lot more ribbed. The ribs are more pronounced on Eric Emanuel's than they are on uniforms. The uniform ribs are much flatter, and the waistband's not as big, which I like. Given how many similarities these two have, especially in price and availability, I know it's super hard to get Eric Emanuel's at this point. It's basically like a Supreme drop, which is super frustrating. I don't see why you wouldn't go with the uniforms considering they give you the extra pocket in the back, much nicer drawstrings, which I'm a guy who likes to hang my drawstrings out and this will look a lot more presentable than these weak drawstrings here. Overall, the construction I think is better on the uniforms and for an identical price, why not get the better product? Okay, t-shirts. Uniform LA Artist Tee, John Elliott Lucky Pocket Tee. $48 for the Uniform LA, $108 for the John Elliott. 10.5 ounce Supima cotton. All John Elliott says on this one is 100% cotton. Uniform shirt feels so much smoother. It feels like a new shirt. John Elliott kind of has that, that vintage, like washed kind of cold, stony feel to it. Whereas the uniform shirt is a much softer kind of like comforting feel. Uniforms got stretch in them. John Elliott, not really much stretch. Just to put it in perspective, I bought this John Elliott shirt probably a year ago now, and it still has the tag on it. I have yet to wear it. I got this uniform LA shirt shortly after getting the John Elliott shirt, and I have worn this probably once a week at least, if not more. If you had the option between the two, which I do, John Elliott shirts, tag still on, Uniform LA shirts, tag off, wore it immediately. Last t-shirt comparison is the Aimé Leon Dor cotton slub pocket t-shirt versus the Uniform LA artist tee. Aimé Leon Dor cotton slub pocket tee retailed for $95. Again, uniform is $48. This shirt is straight up uncomfortable. The cotton is scratchy, it's heavy. I do not enjoy wearing this shirt. Okay, let's check out some fits. Okay, first look, we're going double uniform LA, white artist tee, size XL, navy court shorts, size XL. For reference, my body measurements are approximately five foot, 11 and a half inches, and 220 pounds. With the t-shirt, we got solid body length, not too long but past the waist solid sleeve length right above the elbow i could probably size down to a large but i like my t-shirts with a slightly oversized fit if you like your t-shirts slimmer and match my measurements you could go down to a large here i'm displaying the shorts with the waist rolled up one time to give you an idea of length if you do go with the rolled waist Definitely pulls them up a little bit more above knee, probably about a half an inch compared to a non-rolled waist. And here's how it looks with those draw cords popped out. Compare that look to this one, which has the John Elliott Lucky Pocket Tee in extra large with the Eric Emanuel Bolt Shorts in extra large as well. As you can see, the John Elliott Pocket Tee looks a lot stiffer than the Uniform LA. It, it sits boxier. The Eric Emanuel shorts 
pretty much give you the same aesthetic. They're a little bit shorter. Here you can see with the ra waist rolled up once. They're slightly higher, more above the knee than Uniform LA shorts are. However, they're much lighter. Um, they look, give you a much more like gym short look. Between these two options, I'm sticking with Uniform LA. Pairing two uniform pieces together again. In this outfit, I'm wearing the Artist Long Sleeve T-shirt in gray with the Sunset Court Shorts in navy. The Artist T-shirt is a size extra large and similar to the T-shirt. I could size down to a large and still fit this, but I like the extra space for comfortability. I am loving this twisted tri-blend material. I've been wearing this shirt all day while editing this video, and it's super comfy, breathable, yet still has good weight to it. A very popular California look here, the hoodie with shorts combo. Here I have a Supreme S logo hoodie paired with the Uniform LA Sunset Court shorts. Very casual, comfy vibes here. Good for that spring weather that's kind of in between warm and cold. Again, the shorts are substantial enough to give you a more presentable look than your typical mesh gym short. Lastly, I'm gonna show you a little outfit where I used a Uniform LA Artist Tee in black to layer underneath this flannel. Paired it with some nice white carpenter jeans and some Mocha Jordan 1s. Just giving you an example of how you can wear these t-shirts as a layering piece or by themselves as we saw earlier. If you're interested in picking up any Uniform LA pieces for yourself, I will have links to purchase in the description. Thanks so much for watching the video. This is my first YouTube video. I'm gonna make more in the future, so subscribe to my channel if you wanna check them out. Thanks.